My name is Richard Leader, Fire Chief, Cypress Creek Fire Department, and I'm here to keep you in the know on fire safety. The one thing we'd like every homeowner to know about keeping their home safe is to have smoke detectors in almost every room of their house and to make sure that they check those smoke detectors once a year for a fresh battery. Many of the homes in our subdivisions have smoke detectors, but many of the homes in our subdivisions are also 30 plus years old. So the smoke detectors that were installed by the builders in many of these homes are, have exceeded their 10 year lifespan by the manufacturers. What we'd like people to do is to check their smoke detectors first to make sure they actually work, they have fresh batteries and they work, but also to remove the smoke detector from the wall, check the date on the back of the smoke detector, and if that is over 10 years old, they need to put a new smoke detector in place. Just changing the battery and hitting the test button on the smoke detector will tell you if the alarm circuit is working in the smoke detector, but it will not tell you if the actual alarm elements that make the smoke detector function during the fire are working. That's where we want them to take it off the wall, check the manufacturer's date on the back, and if it's over 10 years old, they need a new smoke detector. Well, one, they have to have a, a fresh battery. If for a smoke detector to function, it has to have power. Uh, many people will remove the batteries from their smoke detectors because they're beeping or they, they burned something on the stove and the smoke detector went off. It's very important that after those events, we go back, we put a fresh battery in the smoke detector and we check that date to make sure it's less than 10 years old. The one other thing we'd like families to do to keep themselves safe uh, during a fire in their house is to practice what we call exit drills in the home. This is very important because in a modern structure fire, you only have about two minutes to get out of the house. Simple thing for exit drill in the home, you have a meeting place outside, everyone knows where that meeting place is. When the smoke detectors go off, everyone should immediately exit the house with their pets and go meet at that exit lo meeting location and do not go back in the house. Once you've exited the house, do not go back in for any reason. Many people have suffered significant injury or death because they went back into a burning structural fire. We have information about fire safety on our website at cypresscreekfire.com.